have here is, we have here is a sitting member of the Liberal Party of Canada, Eric. I'm going to I'm going to question him. You like that, Steve? I'm all over the place. I'm Leo. I'm Leo Lucher. I'm the guy who. I'm the guy when they legalized marijuana and I opened up the shop, and I'm still going to court for it. Oh, this is my wife's shop. And you know what? This is a wonderful day here uh, here today. A lot of people are awesome. This is what the is like. It is. So what's going on in Ottawa? Uh, you know, we're, uh, we're, we're pushing forward. The battery plant is uh, is close to getting done. That's four and a half thousand folks working. Are you running again? I'm kind of running again. But uh, we've got uh, child care that we're fighting for to expand. We've got dental care. We've got 14,000 folks. Right now, I'm getting done with the first time, so um, I really feel like our community is very important. But it's free dental care, right? Oh, no, it's not. No, it's not. I pay my taxes. Nothing's for free. Same thing with their education system. Same thing with the roads. You're always, you know, taxes go to roads, go to education, go to other things, health care. That's how we keep community strong, but it's about investing in this community. That's what's important. You know, I get it. I told Greg LeMay, too. I, I like you, okay? If you... You've done, you've done some pretty good things for the city, right? you got to get away from Justin Trudeau, buddy. Let's just, let's you have keep, to. Let's keep focusing on the numbers, right? Well, listen, this government brought that battery plant here. Right? That's 4,500 folks here. When was the last time any government brought 4,500 jobs here? That's Prime Minister Trudeau. That's the liberal government. It's funny, though, that we brought the, the, the jobs here, right? So if I, if I was to throw three, uh, $10 billion into something, I'm going to bring 4,000. Jobs too. Taxpayers oh, are good. Good. Yeah. But think about it. Ten years ago, ten years ago, there were forty thousand fewer people working in Windsor Essex than there are today under the previous government. Right? We had an automotive sector. We were down to one product at Windsor Assembly. We now have four products by 2026. We'll have four products there. We've got the auto sector and the manufacturing sector being revitalized as we speak. Forty, fifty billion dollars of investment. So we're turning the corner. It's about investing in people, investing in manufacturing, investing. Like ours. I'd rather do that than, uh, than be that's cute. Don't get me wrong. I voted for you. Yeah. Voted for you. Voted for the Liberals. I was a paying member of the Liberal Party oh, for uh, her gray days. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, they were giants. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mark McGuigan. Right. Gray. Not all Liberals are bad. Don't get me wrong. You're a good guy. Mark McGuigan's son's uh, vaccine injured. Eugene Let the vaccine. Yeah. Injured. Mark McGuigan's son. Is vaccine injured? But listen, uh, Leo, we're gonna go walk and uh, talk to some folks. But you can call me anytime. Happy to chat with you. Yeah, you're, you're not gonna call me yeah. back. Happy to reach out. Reach out.